blood test could be the next major cancer breakthrough. It scans for dozens of types of cancer, and the startup that created it says it could save countless lives. According to the company, it could even help doctors locate where the cancer is inside the patient's body. CNBC or NBC's senior national correspondent Kate Snow spoke with a man who says that test may have saved his life. Cancer was the last thing 76-year-old Jim Ford was worried about. Were you in pretty good health? Very good health, yeah. I didn't take any pills. I played golf once or twice a week. Through Sutter Health in California, he volunteered to be part of a study on a blood test that can screen for more than 50 cancers. He was shocked when the results came back positive. Then his physician ordered scans and found stage 2 cancer in his pancreas. Jim and his wife were devastated. She literally collapsed on the living room floor and sobbed. Because we were, we were both thinking it was a death sentence. But that test probably saved his life because the cancer was found early. This is where the processing begins. Dr. Josh Hoffman is president of Grail, a Silicon Valley startup that created the gallery test. Most cancer deaths are happening in cancers that we're not screening for at all. Nobody's so finding them. That's exactly right. Only five major cancers have screening tools like mammograms or colonoscopies. 71% of cancer deaths are caused by other cancers. We're losing almost 2,000 of our loved ones every day. And it's because we're finding most cancer too late. Gallery looks at blood for DNA shed by cancer tumors. If it sees that DNA, then it predicts where the cancer is. So if it says cancer signal detected, predicted location, ovary, the doctor will know to do an imaging test of the pelvis. The gallery test is available now by prescription, but is not covered by insurance. Cost to the patient, $950. A positive result is not always right. Up to half will turn out not to be cancer. But researchers at the National Cancer Institute say the results so far could potentially revolutionize cancer screening, and they're designing bigger studies. After surgery, chemo, and radiation, how are you? Jim's surgical oncologist says his latest scan looks great. To catch it at stage two is a big deal. Yeah, I mean, it's like um, winning the lottery. Jim is hoping his story might save others. He recently got to hold his new granddaughter. I was able to go back and see her. It meant a lot. Those are happy tears, right? Yeah, very much so. I did ask the chief medical officer about those who might think of Theranos and wonder if a blood test really can predict cancer. Is this one real? Their answer to that is that they've been very transparent about their results so far. Their data has been submitted uh, to all the authorities. The National Cancer Institute, as we mentioned, is thinking that this has a lot of promise. For the news, I'm Kate Snow.